वेलकम बैक इनका स्टूडेंट नंबर थ्री ये नहीं चपता रहा उस सर्विंग दम प्लीज वेलकम स्टूडेंट नंबर थ्री ओ कैंसर यू कैन टच मी नॉट माय सोल नाइदर माय थॉट्स नॉर माय हार्ट नो टॉनिक इज सो पावरफुल नो इंसेंटिव इज सो ग्रेट बिलीव इन योर फेथ दैट विल ड्राइव यू विद द कैंसर अ वॉम वेलकम एंड गुड आफ्टरनून टू ऑल जजेस हो यर कैंसर विच इज बी अकर्ड due to the abnormal activities and lifestyle of today's generations and all now i'm here to speak about cancer and its preventions now uh, the first thing that is the reason for the cancer is one is tobacco next is drinking next the lifestyle of the people tobacco if if we are not used to tobacco and if you insist to improve your health of course i think it is a big word if but i think it brings a lot of change and that brings a lot of uh, change in your lifestyle too the next thing your life becomes risky with a whisky so the next thing is lifestyle of today's generation all time sticking with the mobiles everything in cosmetics and all getting addicted to the tv not even getting the eyes get pops out but still you're not coming out of that and still you sit to sit to it and watch constantly so we can cure cancer actually care makes cancer rare so the first thing the awareness should be bought in children i just want to add up an instance to this my cousin she is some 8 years old so she watched in some of the serials that uh, if the hair fall and if you just get some allergy on the skin uh, people think that you get skin cancer and all then she was being affected with some allergy and all then she was like she got cancer she got cancer she was screaming and screaming that i got cancer i got cancer the parents were shocked and then she was stuck to the hospital then they were like no she doesn't have any cancer it's only a skin allergy no i have seen in the serial that i have got cancer mokkai vangani di mrane vanguna this this awareness should be bought in the children from right from their childhood people has a grasping power in their childhood itself they try to grasp the thing around the world they try to motivate themselves they try to change it so we have different techniques in curing the cancer the first thing is mammograms after the 21 years the women been mostly addicted with it so if you just go for the screening test in mammogram up to 70 years i think you will not be affected with the cancer then next come to the colonial cancer so if you just go to, go through this treatment you get a collateral treatment will be given to you where you be no where affected with the cancer next is the pap spam the both men and women should undergo this treatment after 21 years so that they no no longer be affected with the cancer i think people doesn't know about nanotechnology nowadays the nanotechnology has been come into the existence where this nano chips has been inserted in the blood where the blood cells uh, does not get any blood uh, the nano cells obstruct the blood flowing through those blood cells where the blood cells does not get any kind of a blood from this where the cancer cells get died and the no no more cancer will be and en- humiliated in the body so this is how you can just cure uh, cancer by using the nano technology so i just want to say oh cancer thank you for letting me stop and making me remember what's truly important in my life you have started the fight and we are here to finish the fight oh cancer i want to remember you that one thing where we have faith where we believe in the faith we can drive you away we youth are here to drive you away the cancer the thing you need to do is inish invest in the prevention that don't arrive don't allow to arrive the diseases in you thank you for giving me wonderful opportunity thank you viscon అంటే కొత్తగా వచ్చే టెక్నాలజీస్ కావచ్చు అన్నీ వాడచ్చు మొక్క ఇవ్వనిది మ్రాణ ఇవ్వంగున నిజంగానే చిన్న పిల్లలు అంటే ఆ ఏజ్లోనే వాళ్ళకి ఏదైనా అవగాహన కల్పిస్తే మాత్రం అది ఆ వేలోనే వెళ్తుంటుంది కాబట్టి వాళ్ళకి చక్కటి అవగాహన ఉంటుంది క్యాన్సర్ని అవాయిడ్ కూడా చేయొచ్చు తెలిసింది వేరే వాళ్ళకు కూడా మనం ఇంకా స్ప్రెడ్ చేయొచ్చు ఇంకా స్టూడెంట్ నెంబర్ ఫోర్ ఎవరు చూద్దామండి ఏం మాట్లాడతారు ఒకసారి విందాం స్టూడెంట్ నెంబర్ ఫోర్ ప్లీజ్ వెల్కమ్ ఐఎమ్ సారీ టు టెల్ యూ బట్ యూ హ్ క్యాన్సర్ న్యూస్ దగ్గర కెన్ యాక్చువల్లీ మేక్ యువర్ బ్లడ్ రన్ కోల్డ్ రైట్ బికాస్ every year millions of people are devastated by this news of cancer yet when cancer becomes a discussion in family gatherings drawing room conversations or just a subtle topic in elocution contest it is delicately brushed under the carpet in this scenario i think that 
it is important that each one of us would be able to answer three questions what who and how what cancer actually is who are at risk and how can you kill cancer so what as all of us are aware cancer is a name given to collection of diseases that are caused when a group of abnormal cells begin to grow uncontrollably who who are at risk it would be more appropriate if i ask are you at risk the reason or idea behind development of cancer cells in a human body is in coit it may be due to hereditary reasons or personal habits cancer is notoriously stealthy so it is important not to miss those cues experts suggest that whenever you find some major changes in the way your body functions or even feels you must visit a doctor immediately especially if the change persists for more than 3 or 4 weeks because even small and simple symptoms like persistent headache fever cough that refuses to go may be a sign of cancer and now comes the actual question of how how can you kill cancer cancer may be difficult to beat but never impossible the many famous personalities who are cancer crusaders like angelina jolie manisha koirala mumtaz anurag basu who fought cancer and recovered completely the many cancer treatment methodologies like surgery chemotherapy immunotherapy radiotherapy stem cell transplant precision medicine in spite of all this it is important to know what we can do to reduce the global burden of cancer make healthy lifestyle choices whenever a mason is building a house he ensures that he builds it with stronger bricks and good stones in similar way when you are building the house of your life the house of your career make sure that you are building it with stronger bricks if you build it with bricks of smoking drinking unhealthy habits be prepared you would be collapsed soon second learn and teach people about symptoms precautions and treatments of cancer dispel all the myths that lead to discrimination against cancer patients instead of why me say try me in a class of 60 students when a teacher cracks a joke which is very hilarious all the 60 students laughed when she repeated for the second time only 40 of them laughed for the third time no one laughed why we can't laugh over the same joke again and again right when we are not able to laugh over the same joke again and again then why are we crying over the same problem again and again so remember that when you offer life a hope hold on pain ends h o p e it comes up with a miracle and one question that everybody has is that what happens if i alone contribute what happens if i alone change so there is one man who is sitting in a chair busily reading newspaper his 6 year old daughter has come disturbing papa leave it and play with me no he gets very irritated and then hits up with an idea at the corner of newspaper he sees an advertisement which has big india map he tears it makes it into neat pieces gives it to her saying beta this is jigsaw puzzle solve it and come pretty sure that the girl will take more than 2 or 3 hours he gets indulged into reading newspaper but to his surprise the little one comes just in 10 minutes saying papa i am done he gets so mortified how can such a little one solve the puzzle so soon she says papa i saw you when you are tearing the paper right at the back of india map there is face of a man I don't know where Jammu is, where Kerala is, where Tamil Nadu is, but I know where man's forehead is, where man's nose is. She then says, "Papa, I set the person right. The country is right now. So, if you want to set the country right, set yourself as a person right first. Not just me, not just you. Every individual must be that one single change. That me should be that one single step that le- that leads to heights of cancer-free world." on this big day i would promise to be that one step that will lead me to a cancer free world although i know it is more than million steps ahead thank you yes and student number 5 ochare maatladtaro ok sarvinda please you do not know how strong you are until being strong is the only option you have good afternoon to each and every one present here i am imama and i'm here to speak on the topic kill the cancer cancer is an incredibly variable set of diseases a reckless malignant growth of the cells which despite intense amount of research remains poorly understood dozens of factors 
are, have been tied up to increasing rate of cancers like genetics, obesity, exposure to radiations, consumption of alcohol and smoking. Still more factors are there which are said to help prevent the cancers like exercise, having great diet, including fruits and vegetables. Since we all know that half of the cancers and cancer-related diseases are preventable, so why don't we focus on eliminating the cancer by taking preventive measures rather than just by focusing on treating it? Recently, I was just looking after an article wherein I was surprised to know the fact that even drinking hot piping tea can cause you cancer. Researchers have found out that the people who have habituated to drink scalding tea along with smoking and uh, alcohol have five times greater risk to develop cancer, esophageal cancer. Have you ever heard about animal cancers? Yes, animals have cancers too. A topic less discovered and discussed. The cats and dogs we share our home with have cancers too. The dog, the study says that a dog uh, has a cancer uh, which is known as uh, Sticker's uh, sarcoma, which is contagious. Many Tasmanian devils have uh, facial tumors which transform from one devil to another upon contact. However, there is an animal known as uh, the naked mole rat who is immune to cancer. The body of these African m mammals have uh, a substance called hyaluronan, which acts as a lubricant and stops the cancer. This kind of discoveries can help the treatment of the cancer in future. Cancer is one of the leading causes of death with approximately 14 million people, new cases recorded each year. And this number is to be increased by 70% in the next two decades. The treatment of cancer is still in the nascent stages. There is no sure cure treatment for cancer. However, known therapies are immunotherapy, chemotherapy, radiotherapy, etc. Survival rates increases if the cancer is detected in the early stages. Therefore, a person should definitely go for a cancer screening regularly. There are many known tests like mammogram test, pap test, fit test, and chronology. There is a saying by Steve Jobs, who was diagnosed with cancer, that no one wants to die. Even if people want to go to heaven, they do not want to die to get there. Yet, death is the destination we all share. Death is the single best invention of life. It clears away the old and makes room for the new. Right now, the new is you, but somehow, somehow, not too far away from now, you will get old and be cleared away. Sorry to be so dramatic, but it is quite true. Do not let your inner voice be drowned by someone else's opinion. And most importantly, have the courage to listen to your heart and intuitions because somehow they already know what you always wanted to become. At last, I would like to share my contribution towards the cancer awareness. It is not gigantic, but st still I'm trying to take baby steps. Recently there was a presentation in my college where I chose to speak on the topic cancer because I believe charity begins at home. Secondly, I asked my mother and the family to go for a cancer screening test and people, and pass on the same information to the people they know. Because why to wait for the cancer to come? Just eradicate it once and for all. At last I would like to conclude by saying a small message to all the cancer patients around the globe. Do not lose hope because you do not know what tomorrow may bring. Feed your faith and the fears will starve to the death. Thank you. Shall break this down.